the the documentary that was made in 1998, a year till Sunday. What were the was there agreements around that, or like would it was it always going to be published, even if it didn't go as planned? Shall we say? Um, was it? Did you think it was a risk even signing up for that, or can you just talk me through the background of that? Ah, uh, well, it, what that was about was trust really between myself and Pat Comer, like uh, you know, and he obviously did all the the they they had he had tried to do it with Mayo the previous year uh, in the 90, for the 97 All-Ireland. I think he was calling it a month till Sunday. In other words, was, he was trying to, to, to get it from All-Ireland semi-final to final with John Mahan. But obviously, like in my case, the deci- it was easier decision to make because I trust Pat Colmer. Uh, and uh, he was within the dressing room and we weren't conscious of it as it went ahead. Whether it should have been, it would, probably wouldn't have been as big a hit if if it may have been published, but it wouldn't have been as big a hit if we hadn't won the All Ireland. But you know, it was great as the year when you know when you look back on it now, uh, it was scary at times because Pat Comer was sub goalie. So if anything happened to Martin McNamara, for instance, in the All Ireland final, uh, Pat Comer would have to drop his. He had his camera in the dugout in 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 98 final uh, you know to, he the creativity that he you know that he does but like he'd have to drop the camera and head into goals and like if if anything happened uh, negatively my head would have been cut off but i i i uh, i really you know it it, it was a, i think it was a, a a documentary for the ages really that it was a very unusual circumstances and and uh, I'm delighted that it that it was done uh, because I always, as you know, a young supporter, many years, you always wondered what it was like inside the the camp and and the lads. The great thing is the year progressed. You know, Pat would have the he'd have the camera in the duffel bag. You know, when we'd be at team meetings and and so on. I often wondered at the time it couldn't maybe have been shown, but we had. We had, uh, you know, those moments that you were, you know, you wanted to win other All Irelands after it, so you, you weren't giving all the secrets away in it. But we, you know, Keith Wood had a big involvement with us in the lead up to the All Ireland, uh, and I, 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 I think Sapori Joyce did something similar this week. But I, 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 uh, it, it was a, you know, it could have been any county really, but it was, it, it was Galway, and 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 it was look what he did a mighty job on it. So I, I don't regret it. But I often think of what might have happened if things went wrong uh, as a result of his of his distraction, uh, if you like. Uh, but he, he he was a supreme professional, and and uh, he has done many many good ones since. But I think that was that 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 launched him on the the the, the Oscar route, let's say. <laughs>